William Kendridge's large-scale lithograph and collage News from Nowhere is part of what he collectively calls News from the Nose, ideas he explored visually when he received the contract, the commission from the Metropolitan Opera House in New York in 2010 to stage the 1928 Dmitry Sostakovich opera, The Nose. The Nose, of course, refers to the short story written by Nikolai Gogol in 1837. Kentridge made numerous drawings, numerous prints, such as The Horseman, such as Four Shadows, and of course, small-scale sculptures, such as Nose 2, that you see on my uh, right here. Also, video installations, such as uh, I Am Not Me, The Horse Is Not Mine. And of course, this stupendous lithograph that you see over here. Uh, th the story is about a middle-ranged uh, Russian official called collegiate assessor uh, Kovalya, who wakes up one morning to find that his nose has disappeared from his face. In the course of the morning, he tries to locate the nose again and attach it back onto his face, citing it all over uh, St. Petersburg. First, as a much higher ranking officer going into a church, then as a journalist at a newspaper who point blank refuses to place an advertisement for the lost nose, and then as an equestrian figure sitting proudly on a horse, as you can see over here. The nose is about social status, it is about self-esteem, uh, it is about insecurity, but in my mind, above all, it is about the erasure of history. And tellingly, Kendrich portrays an image of Vladimir Ilyich Lenin above that of a portrait of Leon Trotsky. And it is a well-known fact that in the 1920s, after the Russian Revolution of 1917, Trotsky's portrait was routinely airbrushed out of any photographs where the two of them had appeared together. The nose uh, missing from a face signals what can be uh, called a tabula rasa or an empty slate and that is why it is telling that you have a canvas in the middle of uh, this lovely work onto which any image can actually be painted uh, and also the idea of a camera able to capture any image uh, going through the lens here. Incidentally, behind this camera, you have Sergei Eisenstein, the famous Russian film director. At the end of uh, Gogol's story, The Nose, our collegiate assessor, uh, Volyakov, wakes up another morning to find that his nose is back on. Uh, the nurse, uh, uh, disguised as a gentleman about to abscond on a stage coast, was, was arrested by a policeman. And that's why you have the words over there, not the policeman. And he put it in a jar of vodka, purportedly to preserve it, and returned it afterwards to its rightful owner. <laughs>